Covering news where you live. This is 5 News First at 4. House Republicans held their first hearing as part of an impeachment inquiry into President Joe Biden. Thanks for joining us. I'm Alexandra Burnley. And I'm Morgan Wrigley. The hearing was a highly partisan affair, as expected, with Republicans attacking the president and Democrats defending him. Skylar Henry has more details from Capitol Hill. Allegations. The House Oversight Committee held its first hearing into whether President Joe Biden should face impeachment charges. But for the GOP chairman, it's not much of a question. The House Oversight Committee will examine over two dozen pieces of evidence revealing Joe Biden's corruption and abuse of public office. Republicans allege the Biden family received millions of dollars in foreign money through Hunter Biden's business dealings. And when the Department of Justice began investigating, President Biden tried to protect his son. Hunter Biden cashed in by arranging access to Joe Biden, the family brand. Whether President Biden directly benefited from his son Hunter's business dealing sparked contentious debate during Thursday's hearing. The committee has received 12,000 pages of bank records. Here they are, right in front of us, printed double-sided, and not a single page shows a dime going to President Joe Biden. The courts actually have rejected that. They've said that money going to family members is in fact a benefit. The principle of American law is that people are responsible for their own conduct and not the conduct of their adult children. Is that right? That's correct. Thank you. The committee intends to subpoena Hunter Biden and the president's personal and business bank records as early as this week. Skyler Henry, CBS News, Capitol Hill. Democrats also used their time to highlight that Republicans were holding the hearing as Congress faces a budget deadline, a big one, with a looming government shutdown.